I left a note for you on the desk. Oh, how thoughtful. Peggy! Oh, look at you, big guy. No. You probably haven't had your nap what? yet. Hey, that's fine. We'll go out the terrace. I don't care. Peggy? Listen, Michael is tired. Would Stop you please it. take him What are you doing? Decent? Let go. But he's tired. He needs his nap. Must you overreact to everything, Carly? I hope you're watching. Excuse me, have you ever seen me mistreat my child? Have you ever seen Carly behave erratically in front of my son? I don't understand. <sighs> okay. Mommy needs to talk to AJ for a minute. Mommy needs to talk to your Here father. <laughs> you know what? Here, tell Leticia I'll be up in a minute to get him. No, Just she get won't. Him ready. Thank you, Peggy. AJ, you know what? I made up my mind. Hmm. And Michael and I, we're leaving. No, you're not. You are free to go. What are you waiting for? <gasps> or has it just occurred to you that you may not be so welcome empty-handed? Hmm? Go to Jason, find out just how happy he'll be to see you without Michael. Hey, Jay. Hmm? I'll never be without my child. Oh, please, Carly. Motherhood has always been something you can take or leave, you know? Hey, what was the name of that doctor at Ferncliff? Uh, Evans, right? Gee, I wonder what he and the courts will think when they find out that you have walked out on our son for I the third time I never walked in his out short on Michael. Life, I left him with Jason because I knew that he mm. would be safe and he would be loved. And you know what, AJ? What? I gave that little boy the best father he's ever going to have. And no court in America is going to take a two-year-old boy away from his mother <laughs> and a guy who raised him the better part <laughs> of his life. Carly, it's a man who doesn't want you. I'm just trying to save you from yourself, as usual. <laughs> but do you really think that it broke Jason's heart to watch you marry me? Uh, I don't think so. Not like it did when he gave me back Michael. That's the only thing that made you special, Carl. No, that's how you see me. Oh, please. Well, you don't think Jason can get a woman anytime he needs one, huh? You're just a means to an end for him. Oh, wow. The user has finally been used. You could have had everything, Carly. Money, power. Even love. What? Love? I guess that joke's love? on me, right? You call this love? And now you're about to throw it all away for a boot in the backside when Jason finds out that you and my son are not a package deal. Why are you doing this? I don't even, I don't understand. What am I AJ? doing? What are you, why are you trying to keep me? Why are you trying to hurt me? I mean, did you not get what you wanted? <laughs> Everything you wanted. You're, you're the CEO of your family's company and uh -huh. you have an acknowledged place in Michael's life. And you, you cannot be lamenting the loss of me because we didn't marry for, for love, you know. We make each other miserable, actually. You never tried. Oh, you know I did. No, you tried to fit in, but you never tried to be my wife. Well, AJ, you know, you can't try to love somebody. Of course you can. How the hell do you think I ever came to give a damn about you? <sighs> <laughs> Hurts. You're just going to have to try not to. Well, go. Go on, be my guest. You'll be back. Yeah, I will be. <laughs> With lawyers and with the police, if necessary, for Michael. Hey, sweetheart, when uh, Jason slams that door in your face, you'll be back with those crocodile tears. In the meantime, you know, I guess I uh, better decide just how much I'm willing to make you grovel before I take you back. Yeah, right. For the sake of our son, of course. That's it. You see that? She's hanging out with cops. You see her touching his shoulder? 200 yards from my, from my warehouse. Obviously, she thinks she can just, you know, lie about it and cover it up and not believe everything she says. Using her to sink Marino, how using her to clean the kitchen sink isn't worth it. She's gone. I'm throwing her out tonight. Okay. I'll handle him, Marina. I'll kiss and make up. A truce, what do you think? It's what he's wanted. I agreed to a meeting midnight. Pier 52, can you fill in for me? Are you sure Marino's not gonna like it? Well, the hell not. He, 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 he'll, he'll deal with you. If he sees a messenger in that, then fine. That's good, too. I want you to take Darius and Leo with you. 
Let me know how it goes afterwards. Hannah will be long gone. This is... What, you're making special tapes for me now? Yeah, it's just <laughs> something that I, I wanted us to listen to uh, together. Well, I'm dying to. How about right now? That'd be great. Hi, this is Hannah. I get that you're not alone, so just listen. I need to see you now at the Elm Street Pier. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Thank you. You are not gonna believe this. You never know. That last interview I went on, it's between me and another candidate. And they want us to do this presentation tomorrow, so I'm gonna have to rush to the library and do some research before it closes. I'm so sorry. Do you forgive me? I wouldn't dream of interfering with your job. I promise I'm gonna get up to you. You're not cutting me off my case. Sonny Corinthos is going to prison, and he's going to know I put him there. 